an outpouring of emotion today as the family of Lexington murder victim Michael Turpin made their case to a parole board. Keith Bouchard, one of three people convicted in Turpin's 1986 murder, is up for parole again. LX 18's Angie Bevan has more from Frankfurt. Bouchard immediately lunges at Mike and begins stabbing him. Michael Turpin's father, Don Turpin, spoke first, telling the parole board in 31 years it's not gotten easier. You're just in a fog going through the motions trying to figure out why and what has really happened. And what happened in 1986 is rehashed for this family over and over. Keith Bouchard, the man who stabbed Turpin to death, is up for parole again in January. His parole eligibility hearing is tomorrow. Karen Brown and Turpin's wife Elizabeth Turpin were also convicted of murder and have been up for parole in recent years as well. The three plotted to kill Turpin with twists of a love triangle and life insurance money. After Bouchard stabbed him to death in his apartment, he and Brown dumped his body. His wife Elizabeth planned it all. Our main goal is to let them know really how much this has impacted the family and that we really do want him to uh, serve out his time in jail. He should never ever be released because Michael never did a single thing to him. Not a thing. As much as they don't want to keep coming back for meetings like today's. It doesn't open up new wounds like people think it does, because this, uh, this is with us every day. Don Turpin says they will. Covering the news in Frankfurt, Angie Bevan, LEX 18 News.